Hey guys, it's Zarzar here, back with another video. Little Iron Man tip here. Probably should have made this one a while ago, but anyways. This one has to do with herb lore and amulets of chemistry. And everybody knows what amulets of chemistry do. For those who don't know, when making a potion, you have a chance to gain an additional dose of that potion when it's created. What some people don't know is that this also works for crystal dust and amylase crystals. I find this to be very useful when creating stamina potions because, well, it helps you eke out just a little bit more stamina dose from your amylase. As well, as you don't need to go and decant these potions into 4 dose before making them into 4 dose, you can do that after you make all of your stamina. So if you play with your game filter on, you can see exactly when it happens. But sometimes it's hard to see on the 3 dose or the 4 dose, but right there, if you watched my amylase there, it didn't go down by three, it went down by two. Or sorry. <laughs> yeah, it, it, sa it saved me an amylase and gave me an extra dose. So it went down by three and, and gave me four doses, rather. But yeah, that's just a small little Iron Man tip. Can, if you really hate agility, it can help you eke out just a little bit more stamina from those amylase. And again, this also works with crystal dust, so... Instead of making 4 dose super divine combat potions, grab your 1 dose, 2 dose, 3 dose, whatever you have left over in the bank just from sipping, and you will you can eke out some extra doses from your crystals as well. Anyways guys, that's gonna do it for today. Thanks for watching, and I hope that this helps somebody save just a little bit of resources on their herb lord grind.